We begin with those harrowing moments on board a commercial airplane in this country. Extreme turbulence sending passengers hurtling through the air. A flight attendant still hospitalized tonight after hitting the cabin ceiling. So what is the investigation showing happened? Right now, here's ABC's David Curley. Just as the United Airlines 737 was starting its descent into Billings, Montana, a jolt. It felt like something came up from the bottom and hit the bottom of the plane. And then stuff and people were flying all over the place. It was severe turbulence, and those not buckled in were tossed about. He flew up out of his seat and actually hit the ceiling of the uh, ceiling of the aircraft and came down, landed on the lady next to him. The plane seemed to fall for nearly five seconds, its right wing dipping. And as this simulation shows, there was a mother who started screaming when she lost control of her child, a baby who ended up in the air, landing in another seat, luckily unhurt. It's impossible to hold a child during severe turbulence or high G-forces. Crash simulations show how a child can be pulled from their parents' grasp. The reason? A 20-pound baby's weight can triple during a severe event, and our arms just aren't strong enough. There is one approved restraint for aircraft, and of course, you can use a car seat. If you fly, you know that turbulence is a common occurrence, but it can happen without any warning. And those who are normally injured are members of the crew. The last 10 years of records show that on average, there are 32 injuries every year. And two-thirds of those are to crew members, often flight attendants. That's exactly what happened on the United flight, leading the captain to declare a medical emergency. Bleeding pretty badly and they can't get it to stop, so they're requesting a medical attention at the gate. Right behind my right hand shoulder was the stewardess. I seen her flying back and forth. One flight attendant is hospitalized tonight in serious condition. Two others and two passengers were treated and released after that violent flight through turbulent air. The unexpected turbulence is the reason that flight crews strongly suggest that whenever you're in your seat, you keep your seatbelt buckled.